Today's hottest topic in more ways than one is the environment. Scientists around the world are researching climate change and its effects. Lufthansa has also been involved in environmental protection for many years, supporting numerous research projects and initiatives. I believe it's a good thing that it's under discussion because environmental impact is a vital topic. Today, we're already at the stage where our entire fleet, from the smallest regional aircraft to the jumbo jet, use an average 4.4 litres of fuel per passenger per 100 kilometres. But Lufthansa still isn't satisfied. Environmental protection and everything to do with it has long been a tradition in the company. Lufthansa has been involved in researching the basic principles of climate change for over 13 years. It started in 1993 with our Mosaic project. Several long-haul aircraft were re-equipped with devices that measured trace elements such as water vapor and ozone during the course of their routine flights. Today, this has given us a data set that's absolutely unique, which has been used to refine and improve climate models. Monthly data delivered by Lufthansa aircraft is evaluated at the Ulich Research Center. This information flows directly into the current research work. Today, the assumption is that only a small percentage of all CO2 emissions is due to air transport. The air we fly in, our atmosphere, is a highly complicated system we're still a long way from understanding fully. For instance, it's not only significant what gases are present and in which concentrations, but also where they're located. Our atmosphere can be divided up into layers. The lowest layer is the troposphere, then comes the stratosphere, and the layer that divides these is the tropopause, which plays a decisive role in our climate. Here, in contrast to satellites and terrestrial stations, long-haul aircraft are the ideal measuring platforms for gathering high-resolution data. Over 100 kilograms of high-tech on its way to work. Every 30 days, specialists from the Ulich Research Center ensure that the mosaic measuring stations are kept up to standard. Thanks to Lufthansa Technik, they're all certified and tested for safe operation in commercial aircraft. Every four seconds, the measuring instruments on board Mosaic record parameters that provide additional impetus to climate research. Numerous questions raised by atmospheric research have meanwhile been answered by Mosaic. Mosaic is and always has been a success and has an ambitious successor in Iagos. Apart from ice supersaturation, the carbon monoxide and nitrogen monoxide measurements have also delivered interesting results. Namely, that many more pollutants from the boundary layer, from traffic, forest fires, etc., are transported into the upper troposphere and the lower stratosphere than we had assumed up till now, and than is possible for us to simulate with models at this point. What we want to achieve with the Argos is to combine Mosaic and its sister project Caribic, also supported by Lufthansa, into a single Europe-wide infrastructure. Then, in the expansion stage, we'll equip between 10 and 20 aircraft. And these will all be on climate research duty when they fly, to protect the environment. In this way, Lufthansa accepts its share of social responsibility. We don't have our heads in the sand, we face up to the issues.